Okay, I want to turn 58, or I think turn 3 or 4 of waiting for this ceasefire. Um, the Hellcat got a shot off at the King Tiger last turn, and it managed to not try and put a shot into the juicy, thinner, potentially uh, actual effective uh, target of the side turret armor of the King Tiger there. Instead, it bounced it off the frontal plate, which was, yeah. So, to some extent, the Hellcat kind of deserves to die here, uh, which it may well do because the uh, King Tiger is swiveling on target. Uh, I've given it the order to reverse. Uh, it may or may not make it. It may or may not get another shot off. Uh, but given the angles here and the way the turret is now moved, I don't think it's actually going to uh, succeed. Uh, the Greyhound is going to be popping up here, enfilading down here. Still has some canister. Let's see some canister again. That's what we really want. Um, this Greyhound is busy machine gunning things. No HE left, unfortunately. Uh, all these guys are falling back. We are about to run out of ammunition uh, for the 60mm mortars. Yeah, if the Hellcat dies, I might actually surrender. Uh, because there's no sense prolonging the inevitable. So let's just uh, press go and we will see what we get. Yeah. Oh, it's a 60 ton monstrosity. 200 meters away, Mr. Hellcat, and you missed. Well done. Uh, but at least it probably gave Titan the heebie-jeebies for a, a little bit. Uh, looks like Titan's moving some troops forward to the, uh, the church, so hopefully we're going to open up on them. Uh, get some uh, casualties in. And oh yeah, it looks actually it looks like the uh, I missed that the uh, the greyhound just got nobbled by something. The king tiger probably. Uh, did the this greyhound see anything? What would be actually quite entertaining would be to see if we could run the uh, the greyhound up into say this orchard, uh, where actually that's a terrible idea, hapless. It can't see anything, but I wonder if it can actually kill a. Now, I don't think we'd be able to actually kill a panther from the side, but we may as well find out. I mean, why not? Um, yeah, let's watch the, uh, the Hellcats skedaddling away. Gets a shot off, but misses. Yeah, it's not going to do anything to that King Tiger from that angle. Yeah, that is a uh, non-starter right there. Uh, up here, what did we get? Well, I gave these guys orders to get in the, uh, the front of the church. Instead, they're just getting machine guns. Well done, guys. So, at least the, uh, the mortar team here. Well, somebody's shooting at these guys. Yeah, it is the mortar team. The grease gunner. Well, the Thompson just saw them for a fraction of a second and didn't hit any of them. Go on. Am I being dumb here? Are they all like crawling on top of each other? I think they are. Great. Awesome. Oh yeah, what happened? I think it's the King Tiger. Yes, it is the King Tiger. Uh, yeah, so they're dead.
I do kind of think we're at the end of the tether here. Still no ceasefire. Uh, do, am I actually going to press that surrender button? Because kind of just uh, we're out of options and it's just kind of prolonging the inevitable We are kind of at the end of our tether, my tether here. It's certainly uh, uh, stopped being particularly fun. We're just waiting to get destroyed, so um, I don't want to. But uh, I also kind of don't want to just spend time and effort um, being crushed. So yeah, let's push that button. Well, yeah, the ceasefire's out there. Let's push the button and then we'll go concentrate on the attack. Uh... Oh, this is difficult. Okay, there we go. Yeah, we'll see how it pans out. Uh, it might be a lot closer than it looks, uh, but at the same time... Um... Just uh, kind of don't really want to play it anymore. Uh, we'll see what kind of result we get out of that one. Okay, so turn 59 for the attack for heavy hitters. Uh, we are pushing on here. I'm kind of 50 50. Uh, I mean, the ceasefire is out there, but um, you know, part of me sort of wants to win, but there is a kind of more overriding part that it's really actually kind of tired of all this and just wants it to kind of go away a bit. So, mmm, yeah. Uh, that was one that's worth a think. Because uh, we've got the half track platoon going this way. Ulrich is just going to drive rapid circle. Um, and these guys are starting off. Yeah. So I am a little, you know, unsure of what to do here. Uh, but these guys are clearly having like zero problems. We just lost sight of the uh, annoying sniper team, or yes, at least one of them's dead. That'll that'll do me. And over in the uh, in the church, yeah, the whole Titans moving a bazooka up. I'm sure that's not gonna be able to get eyes on the panther. There. Uh, and then, of course, we've got the uh, platoon steaming around the back here as well, uh, which is having no problems at all. How interesting is that? Uh, yeah, up they go there.
moves that moves the uh, the panther up. I really want actually a bead on one of these buildings over here. Uh, but I don't think we're going to get it. Those guys still have plenty of orders, don't they? That's good. I mean, the ceasefire's out there, so if, uh, you know, Titan's out there, uh, out there, Titan wants the ceasefire, then he can. I'm kind of, I'm tempted to give up, because I don't want to string it on, and because, um, don't particularly care if I win. I've kind of lost a lot of motivation to play this. Part of that is uh, to do with getting, you know, caught with my pants down here because, you know, sometimes you do take a bit of a psychological hit and uh, it's difficult to stand up from it, even though we're probably in a... Um, Yeah, we're still in a, actually in a very strong position here. But, uh, you know, we'll keep it going for a bit. At least. <laughs> 